Hello folks. The Otter Valley Railroad has really been expanded since the last time I visited it here in Sibley. So please enjoy the ride through the beautiful scenery and the production we produce tonight, including a rescue of a crashed auto on the tracks by Air One. Also, make sure you stick around and hear the history and meet the members at the end too. So here we go. All aboard! Well, here's some interesting facts about the layout. Well, the track is divided into three mains, each with several sidings. The mains, one and two, each have a yard. The total track laid in is about 1,630 feet with 93 turnouts or switches. Approximately 2,000 pounds of plaster materials were used for landscaping. Interestingly, these trains are operated with handheld remote throttles using a train engineer RC system, which is DC system of electrically isolated blocks of track. While there are no rules that require each train to be 100% accurate, nearly every train will be theme correct. Members often bring their trains to run, and they consist mostly of traditionally passenger or historical trains. The members of the Northwest Iowa Model Railroad Club welcome you to the Otter Valley Railroad and hope you'll leave with a greater appreciation of railroading and a therapeutic hobby. There is no charge for the public viewing of this layout, so come on down. We've got a problem. It looks like a car is stuck on the tracks. I won't be able to stop in time. I'll call Air One if you can come help out. 
and train this man for going to Air One. This is Air One. How can I help? We have a crashed car on the track. Half number truck. Can you get it off? Well, I'm near and I'm on my way. I'll use the electromagnetic voice. Thanks a lot. Please hurry. Okay, I'm here and I'm dropping the magnet now. This is going to be close. Okay, this is there one. I got it. I'm lifting it off now. Wow, that was just a sign. Thank you, Air One and Dispatch. No problem. Really glad to help. Great. See you when you get back. Okay, all safe and back at the station. Let's meet the members of this club who built this amazing display. Okay, we're here at the Otter Valley Model Railroad. And you are? I'm Richard Engler, our current president of the uh, layout, uh, the club. Uh, secretary, uh, treasurer, janitor, the what? <laughs> the janitor. <laughs> janitor, whatever. And and uh, the rest of the club members are here. Let's let's start with you. What's your name? Well, I'm John Galstead, and I'm from Worthington. I'm a newcomer. I've only been coming down here for about 15, 20 years. That's a pretty good uh, seniority. And you, sir? I'm Daryl Tarrant from Sibley here, and I've been around since 89 or so, and I changed the light bulbs. And, uh, I can uh, tell you got about a two-inch <laughs> clearance there. <laughs> and? Dennis Jurgens. I am my chief operations officer. And vice president. And vice president. Um, one of the originators. Took some time off, came back, what, a year ago. I'm Scott Husengay from Sibley, and I've been here since the start, and I don't have a specific job. He, he's, he's, our, a, he's asking for it now, he's, right? He's, he's our, our current, our current uh, scenery expert. Oh, and well, the scenery in here is amazing, I'll tell you. He's our re relationship to the fair board. I'm also oh. on the county fair board. Well, how about a little history? How long have you been doing it? What's We started this in 1986. Uh, Myself asked if I could bring down a small uh, scale, HO scale passenger train. Uh, Scott seen it and another member seen it and uh, we decided, they bought some down, we decided this would be a good place to start building. We started in the south half in uh, 1986 and uh, then we moved to the back, half, the back part here, the big yard. And it's called the Ken Saul Yard, named after one of the old teachers from up town here. And then uh, we decided we needed to take up the rest of the room on the north side to give us more trackage. So right now we're running about 2,000 feet of track. We're always building on it. Uh, we, our current process of making portals and tunnels back again that we took out in an expanded number two track that you'll see on the layout, on the video. So yeah, we've been very busy. Uh, the members of the Northwest Iowa Model Railroad Club welcome anybody. The Otter Valley Railroad hopes to have you come down and there's no charge. We're usually down here on Wednesdays and sometimes on Saturday morning. Wednesday night about seven o'clock. You're all welcome. All right. And well, that's fantastic. Here is the middle of July, and we're open for about five or six days then. So everybody can come in and see yes. the the thing. So you get pretty good crowd then, yes. I'll bet. Yeah, yes. this has got to be a big attraction. It is. It's one of the bigger attractions in the fair. Oh yeah. Uh, for especially if it's hot out there, it's cool down here, and they like to bring down their steam locals that have all the sound in them. Oh. He happens not to be here today. He's from Spirit Lake. So we've got members from all over. Edgerton, Minnesota, Lemars, Iowa, Spirit Lake, uh, Worthington. So they're from all over. Well, that's fantastic. And I appreciate you letting me come in tonight and put together some kind of little production here. And I hope everybody will enjoy it when we get it all done. Sure we will. Thank, Thank you, Dave. You. Thank You're you. welcome. Thanks. Appreciate it.